So let's solve some exponential equations here. Now to begin that, we need to understand a basic idea. So imagine if you have some base to the m equals some base, the same base to the nth, what do you think can be said? Well, yeah, m equals n. So we just have a three step short process of how we can solve equations that are exponentials. So let's write an example here to begin with. I have two to the three x minus eight equals 16. So how do we solve that? Well, our first step is we need to rewrite it so that they have the same bases. So we have to figure out, can we find a common base between a two and a 16? And we can because both of those can be rewritten in base two. This one's already done for us. How do we write 16 as base two? That's two to the fourth. Two times two times two times two is a 16. Now I have common bases, so I'll go to step two is, we'll set the exponents equal to each other. Three x minus eight equals four. And from there, we just kind of put it in cruise control. Add eight to both sides. That one's solved, x equals four. That's the value that makes this exponential equation true. All right, let's add one little, add another piece to it. So I have 27 to the x plus three equals nine to the x minus one. First thing we need to do is rewrite these so they have the same base. So can they both be written on base nine? This is where our, our understanding of what different bases are. Both of these are numbers that are in base three world. 27 is three cubed. So let's rewrite that as three cubed. And then I have this x plus three still there. So do you see it still says 27 to the x plus three. Then likewise nine, I can write that in base three world as well. And that's three squared along with the x minus one that's still attached to that. We have the common base now, so let's set the exponents equal to each other. Three times x plus three equals two times x minus one. Matter just simply solving. x equals negative 11. The key part in this process is your ability to identify common bases. If you're able to do that, you're going to be able to move forward fairly straight or move forward fairly easily.